Well, hello there, and welcome to an exciting stream. Uh, I'm going to be playing some Seven Days to Die, and I'm really, really hoping that my new uh, crazy setup here is going to work. I have just chat set up on a second monitor, hits my television. So when I look up, I'll be looking up at chat, and then when I look here on the screen in front of me, I'll be looking at Seven Days to Die, and I'm hoping that that is uh, all going to work out swimmingly, uh, but I guess we're going to find out. Um, I'm concerned that if I begin playing the game with extended monitor like this, that it's going to cause my character to, to look infinitely in that direction. I don't know. I might need to go into display settings briefly and make some modifications there. Uh, indeed, it seems the wise choice oh god oh god oh god yeah there we go okay so devices display settings one and two there we go okay so i want one to play that and i want it to be maybe show only on one Show only on two. Show only on one. No, I don't like that. Oh boy. Guys, I think I done it now. All the music stopped. You can't hear no game audio neither. I'm going to close seven days to die and I'm going to open it back up and I'm going to really, really hope that that works. Okay. Okay. I'll put the seven days to die up there. No, 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 no. We'll put the, we'll put this over here. Yeah, there we go. And then I'll put the, the seven days to die over on this one. And we'll hope, we'll hope that works. I sure hope it works. Do you hope it works? I sure hope so. I never done nothing with with two monitors before. This is I hope you're enjoying this exciting experience of Oh no. Oh it's not working guys. Alright. Hang on a second. We're gonna go over here. We're gonna to go to system preferences. I'm gonna to go to devices, headphones. Yep, that's what I want. Display settings. Yep. Set it to one. Set it to two. I don't know. I don't even know, guys. Yeah, you don't. You don't hear the game audio at all, do you? I fucked up. Uh, sound. There we go. Master volume. It shows that it's working. Ah, it thinks my TV is the audio thing, but if I hit headphones... <laughs> now you can hear everything and I can hear everything. And everybody's happy, and that's the way it's supposed to be. So I'm going to go ahead and hit continue game. And I'm going to play my game Frozen Pizza. Buh, the game I've been playing mostly. I gone, I've gone a long way in there. But Frozen Pizza, this is a relatively new one that I started on the stream. So roughly six minutes in, I'm now actually ready to play this. Hey, does it look like I'm sitting in my chair kind of funny? It's because I'm actually sitting on the ground in front of my chair. I don't know how long I'm going to be able to do this without going insane. But we'll find out. Now the next question is, because I can see my cursor when it gets to the edge of the screen moves over here. Moves moves off the screen. And it moves onto my monitor up top. Which is freaking me out to some extent. So I'm hoping that when I'm controlling the actual camera, that that won't happen. 
but we're gonna find out. Oh boy. Oh boy. Yeah. Oh boy. There's some there's some great frame right there. Oh boy. Oh boy. Yeah. Okay. So I might need to go in and do some uh, video stuff over here. Yeah, no, that's that's that. Okay, well that's that's just where we're at. That's your frame rate. I hope you enjoy it. Hope you like that, guys. Looks like garbage. <gasps> A baby! My baby's watching. Hello, baby. How you doing? My character is is deeply deeply infected. Uh, he's got a 20.4% infection rating. Um, finally finished tech stuff. That sounds that sounds just awesome. I bet that I bet that was a real good time. Um, I hope that it all goes smoothly and that they don't try to. Yeah, no, well, that's not good, because I have to imagine you went into it like, this is going to suck, and then it sucked more than you thought it was going to suck, so, because I can't imagine going into it, like, optimistically. Who's going to go into taxes and be like, ah, this is going to be freaking easy, so I'm guessing you went into it like, oh god, this is going to be awful, and then instead of being awful, it was, like, apocalyptic, which is great. Well, here's the thing. My mom's a former accountant, so she does the vast majority of of all of the family's tax stuff for everybody. And I bet when I'm older and she has died, learning how to do my own taxes is going to be the worst thing that's ever happened to me as a person. So what I'm saying is, mom, please don't die. Because I, I don't want to do my taxes. I really don't want to do my taxes. It sounds just awful. But in the meantime, babe, I am, I am sympathetic and apologetic that you had to go through that. I explored. I explored the hell out of the hospital. I guess I'm just going to start exploring random houses in this neighborhood. Because my character needs food. I've already explored this one. So I'll explore that one. You need food. Like in hey, at Pigums. Hey Pigums, I'm sorry, but I need food. Wow. That's a that's a hearty Pigums right there. That Pigums just withstood several shots from a 9mm. And while I'm willing to believe I'm willing to believe that that Pigums could withstand more than one shot. I'm going with five being, <laughs> being too many. Five bullets is too many bullets for a Pigums, is what I'm saying. Oh yeah, no, it was, it was coming up on top of that car. It was going to start trying to kick my ass. That pig was like, you shot me? How dare you? And just just got right up in my in my business, but I harvested thirty meat from it, so that's that's good. Who's that? Who's there? So I finished Until Dawn, and I had a really nice stream with um, Lanimoso and uh, uh, Curry Lady and uh, Shadow 
McCreeper, Sh- Shady McCreeper boy. Um, they were all they were all fun and they were all nice, and we had we had much fun playing until dawn together. Everybody survived except for Chris and Mike. So I killed most of the boys, is what I'm saying. But every lady, every lady lived to tell the tale. Two deaths in that in the scale of that game is actually really not bad. And I had a policy from from like minute one. It was like, whatever happens happens. Oh, and the and the dog, I saved the dog, baby. Because I'm not letting anything happen. Nothing bad happens to a dog, not even an imaginary dog, while I'm on the scene. That's my rule. Yeah, yeah, you do something bad to a dog in front of Pat, you're going to pay. That's, oh, shit. I I wasn't expecting that. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay, I might want to aim down the sights. (laughs) Uh, That didn't go well at all. I can hear somebody just wailing away on something out there. What What is what is happening out here? There we go. Wow, it's it's just silent now. That's spooky. Spooky how quiet it gets. So yeah, I'm I'm sitting on the floor. And I I got to tell you, it it does not feel great on on my spine. This is not a, this is not an ideal solution. Um Because, like, as I tell my viewers, I'm old. I mean, I'm not that old. But I'm old enough. Well, because I don't have a table that's actually at the right level so that I can play the game on my laptop without, like, hunching over it. Like, I could... All right. I'm going to... Because the hunching over, at least that I'm used to. Because... Because I've had terrible posture my entire life, but I, I just I I couldn't. It just this angle, <laughs> aha! <laughs> like I can move the laptop. I guess I could put it on something. No, yeah, but this is it's, there's not a surface in my game room that that even close to works for the for a. <sighs> I guess, um, I mean, I could, I could, I could pick the laptop up. Um, yeah, and I could pick the laptop up and I can put the microphone here. And this, <laughs> this is the most disconcerting view I think that anybody has ever witnessed in, in streaming history. I'm like, <laughs> oh, and well, 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 let's just come in here and take a taste of my beer. <laughs> Um, but I do have, I've got the cool chair above me. It's intimate. Aw, that's sweet. Yeah. What a, what a sweet family channel that, that was that I tuned into the other night on Twitch. There was a, there was a beardy gentleman there in some sort of a high backed chair that he, he, uh, constructed and boy, was I just up in his business. Who's, who's moving? Nobody's allowed to be moving. Okay. Yeah, see, you all think I'm coming in through there, but you're wrong. Uh, 
I'm gonna hit him in the knee. I got him in the knee. I wanna break them knees. Yeah, oh my god, it works. This is that was a valid strategy. What, the, what is happening out here? Okay. Well, alright, everybody. How many of you are there exactly? Oh, okay, it's a big boy. I got it. This game's a lot more upsetting when you have on headphones. I can tell you that. Tunk. 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 The sound effects are just grisly. Oh my god. That sound effect was just awful. I'm, I was genuinely grossed out by that. All right, there we go. It's it's intimate. I like it. I gotta get the microphone in a little closer too. There you go. There you go. Have a shifty of old Pat. Get a get a snoot full of Pat. Why don't you? Uh, so yeah, it is super nice stream, and um, now I'm doing a another stream. I. Uh, I don't like that I separate them, but it, it kind of needs to be done. Ah. Everybody loves a good photo of their dad wearing lab goggles. All right, she's all the way up in the attic. She'll find her way down. Give her time. Ow, I'm stuck in a corner. Ah! I told you she'd find her way down. Ah, <laughs> uh, uh, that sense. It's grim. They got so once you get it up and running it it runs pretty smooth huh I mean the frame rate looks alright it doesn't look too choppy Well, who was that? Bonk. Bonk. <laughs> I love that one. That's a good one. I wonder if I could play Hunt. That'd be freaking rad. Mmm. A really clever bitch. Behind, behind that couch. So, yeah, what's weird, this game, plenty of viewers. A fairly substantial number of viewers watching this game. Randoms popping into chat, saying hi. Not much. I played this game with... Oh, boy. Oh boy.
Well, guys. You guys. gonna make it out of that that I scoured that entire house there's there was nobody there and then I I fall into one room and they're like oh surprise there's fucking 40 of us bullshit all right I'm done um somebody's outside my house why's my fireplace on Gonna need a knife and an AK 47 and the ammunition with which to operate that AK 47. And some painkillers. Uh, but Until Dawn, a game that has relatively little viewership in general. Uh, netted me a whole bunch of brand new uh, viewers who followed. And I just think that's kind of bonkers, you know? There really doesn't seem to be any kind of rhyme or reason as to why people decide to watch one channel versus another. I'm going to get up a close and personal. Oh, yeah. No, this hunting knife? Absolutely not the weapon to go with. I like the fact that it strikes faster. That's fun. But its range is so abysmal. Jesus Christ! My character is apparently very badly insulated from hot weather. So I need to get inside. Lest he faint. This is not even the house that I broke into, is it? That's... I'm in the wrong house. how you take apart a set of spikes. One at a time. What about a gun? Nope, that doesn't work at all. Ugh. 
<laughs> Boy. More water than he can shake a stick in. I need to get back to my body. Need to get to my body. Down out of the bed. Weeble! There we go. There's all my stuff. Just what I needed. A bunch of stuff. I'm encumbered. I'm gonna... Oh, boy. Alright, we're gonna need a halfway decent club. Instead of this club. Because it's garbage. I'm gonna need this knife to go away. And this knife to not go away. I'm gonna need... Well, God, I don't even know. Nobody needs broken glass for any reason ever. Need to eat this here honey. A stockpile of meth making materials. Aha. Uh -huh. Are you really all like right back where you were? And as for you, sir, <laughs> sometimes it's just better to use an AK-47 to shoot somebody in the head. Those times that you're considering stabbing a zombie to death, consider the AK-47 instead. Wrong tool for the job? We know. That's why you always break pictures, kids. I appear to be encumbered. Oh no. Sham way foods. Open that box up. Need to get in at all of that food. Ah, some sandwiches. Some gross sandwiches. Read them books, kids. They contain everything you could hope to know. Carefully picking this lock. Kit. How many lockpicks do I have? One. Yeah, let's go ahead and waste it up. Screw you. Uh -huh. I'll wear these iron boots. No, I won't. I'll... Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh. Oh boy. I don't even know what just happened. What I do know is that my character is looking good. That's a that's a handsome boy right there. I'll take them scrap gloves over them iron gloves. I don't know. The iron gloves have a certain je ne sais quoi. But I don't know what it is. There we go. Bust that up into, a cons into its constituent. Which no, I don't want. A ch no, I don't want an office chair. Under what set of circumstances would I ever want an office chair? Swinging away. Ta 
time is it? 8.30? Is less dramatic than I hoped it would be. I get my wrench. I don't have my wrench. That's right, my wrench was useless. I feel like you know what you ought to do on this game. Whenever your character is running low on food. And your stamina is starting to get low. Kill yourself. Get eaten by zombies. Because then your character wakes up with full stamina. Yep, stripper zombie. What you doing wandering around over here, honey? You ever been hit in the head with a sledgehammer before? Oh my god. Those chicks are just awful. And I'm consistently attracting them on a regular basis, which I find upsetting because I don't really have a well-established base yet. It hasn't been that many nights. I don't understand why I would have a large collection of Zed coming after me yet. Is it because I picked the hospital? Do they proportionally increase the difficulty of your opponents based on the fortitude of your stronghold? I have so many questions. Landed a hit right to the dome. Right in the noggin. Oh, it's a face only a mother could love. And I ain't your mother. Hey, buddy. Nice. There we go. Alright. Now that we've had it out with the locals. What the hell am I doing? Just trying to get just trying to get back to my base.
Yeah, so they've already worn that down substantially. I don't like that. It's like she knows where I'm at. I'm gonna need some gross charred meat. A heap and helping of it, you might say. I'm gonna need some water. Which I guess I'll go in here for now. There we go. Put that in there. Right, a little of this, a little of that, a little of everything. Here, have some fat and some gross meat. Have some... Oh, character needs a drink. Have some medical stuff and some that, 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 this, one of them, two of those. No, I'm kidding. Oops. There we go. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Oh, okay. You can sort it. Well, that's fun. It's not what I wanted to do, but it's fun. There we go. Okay, yeah, go ahead and sort that. That's fun. I like that, honey. I'm gonna do this. 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 Go ahead and sort that for me. I'm gonna throw some of that in there. Sort that as well. Good. Good. That's just what we need. What do we got? A food pantry over here? A food pantry. Good. All right, I got some sandwiches. Got a little bit of roast beef. Got some drugs. You kids like drugs, right? Good, okay. All right. And then right over here to the weapons drawer. And then just organize that for me again. There we go. Okay. So now I think I'm ready to face the world. And of course that means I have zero viewers right now because nobody wants to watch this game. And frankly... I don't really want to be playing it anyway, so I'm going to switch. So I'll see you later. Have a good night.